course the first thing we're going to start off with is primer so you want to apply this all over the lid if you've got very thin eyelids and very pale skin like me you've probably noticed that some of your veins show up underneath the skin and to cover this I'm just going to take an eyeshadow which is a similar colour to my own skin tone and use this to really lightly cover the lid. It's not going to cover everything, but it should stop the veins from being so prominent. If you're a little bit worried about messing up later, you can take a white highliner and just really lightly mark out the area that you're going to be lining in. Now we're going to take a black highliner and just starting on the lower lid, we're going to cover that entire line and create a kind of loose wiggle in the bottom lower corner. And then we're going to bring it all the way around the eye, over the lid and back to the inner corner where we're also going to do a loose wiggle. So we're going to sketch out the flags and you just want to start on the outer corner and then gradually work your way around. They need to get bigger the closer they get to your eyebrows and then kind of fade out towards the end. And don't worry if it's not neat at the moment, it doesn't matter, we're just sketching it out and we'll neaten it up later. And after you've done this we're going to go for a red eyeshadow and we're just going to fill in every other flag. You could use a paintbrush or a really fine makeup brush for this but I'm going to be using some nail art brushes because they're fantastic for getting little details. And after we've filled in the red flags, we're going to be using a blue eyeliner and we're going to fill in the rest. Now that you've filled in the flags, now we're going to take the black eyeliner and just neaten everything up. So make sure that the outside of the flags are lined, also the line around the crease, make sure that's really thick and strong because we really want it to stand out, we don't want it to look weak and muted. And then, because you know me, I'm an absolute rhinestone freak, I'm going to put two rhinestones at the end. And finish off with false lashes, or mascara, if that's what you prefer. I'm also going to line the lids, just so that it looks a little bit neater. If you want, you can also apply mascara on the lower lid, but I'm not going to do that. And I'm just going to finish off with some red lip liner and a red lip gloss. And that's it, you're done.